here back with another beautiful project. Take a step back, take a look at it. This is a call from Google. And uh, let me go ahead and hook the hose up right away. And anyway, called me, came out, and fortunately for him, you know, he called and said, Look, I'm in a kind of in a rush. I got a company coming in this weekend. I know it's a last minute situation. Fortunately for him, I have a client that pushed out a uh, wash that we had scheduled today, this evening. So I was like, you know what? We're ready. So anyway, we're here now just hooking up our water. And you see these Flexilla's ho hoses? They're really nice. There's two different ones. There's one like this. And then there's one that has like a handle on it. If you're going to buy one, get the one with the handle on it because it's a little easier to turn and get on the hose. Anyway, this thing it's just jacked up a little bit. There you go. Uh, so anyway, we we'll go ahead and get our tank filling. First thing we do when we get to a job that way we, we we always know we got enough water. Sounds like good flow, and we always pull the hose all the way off the reel to get maximum flow. So we'll do that here, and this is going to be a uh, house wash with a, uh, a little bit of flat work, not the driveway, just around the house and back there in the back patio. So I'm just gonna go ahead and pull hoses to hone his own property protection with, again, being efficient, guys. And what I mean efficient is efficient, doing a great job being efficient, right? That's the whole name of the game. That's why we built the beast. So we could spray this whole side of the house, not a problem, and uh, run with it, you know, and I can finish it. Boom, I can hit this side and this side quick. But we got to get the big ladder out because on the back there is a little bit of gutter work we're going to clean off. They got leaf guards. Again, upselling. So, anyway, let us get set up. Water's already full, pretty much. Well, not full, but we got a lot of water. We're carrying more. And we're ready to roll. So, catch up with you in a minute. Right, look, this is that dinginess I was telling you. Now, this concrete was laid, he said, about a year ago. So, we're not going to surface clean it. We're going to just put a, a downstream on it and use some flow. Yeah, Tony's up here. Get on the roof real quick. We're just gonna blow out some gutters. Part of the gig, you know. Uh, and with that, we're gonna do this back patio. Is what I'm talking. But this is all new concrete, so we're not gonna we're not gonna hit it hard. All right, guys, catch up with you. Let me help Tony. All right, peace. Got all the hose pulled. Tony's on the roof catching that last bit of the gutters. We got our downstream set up. We're gonna turn our box on. And what I plan to do, as you can see, it's got a U-shaped driveway, so I want to end right here. And the reason I want to end right here is because I can reel it right up. So I'm going to start over on that end, maybe the front, that end, catch the back, and quickly catch this. And we're trying to find a light switch for these lights, but they keep coming on, so I don't know. Just have to work around and maybe just shoot water right there. Anyway, uh, all right, guys, let me get, let me get rolling. Let's go start the machine up. Let's see how the beast rolls. A fuel injection IGX 800. Got the ball valve open, of course. I always keep that open on, on start up and shutdowns. No problem. All good, baby. Fuel injector never fails. All right, let me go ahead and get my setup. I'm going to use the gun of choice. Obviously, it's going to be the M5 twist and the David Shooter tip. With the little setup, get a lot of people asking me about this. This is just a David Shooter tip. And a two nozzle holder from Davis Shooter Tip. And this is just an M5 twist with a two inch nipple. That's it. 2605 Sutner gun. We're good. Alright, guys. Peace. A painted uh, side and house. We don't usually have problems with this color, but you know what they say, huh? Do a test spot. So we're going to let that marinate for a little bit. Hit a quick test spot. And if it changes, well, we've got problems. But I don't think so. He said he had a wash last year with somebody else, but they didn't do such a great job. So he called all pro to take care of them because that's what we do anyway i'm gonna let this marinate for a few minutes and then i'm gonna uh, hit the front of this house you can see up there look at all of the, the nasty webs and bugs and just things like that that's all it is it, i mean it's not growth it's more bug bug issue in, the, in that little crown molding or whatever that molding up top so we're gonna get it but yeah we look like we're not getting no reaction let it sit for a little bit and then uh, go from there. All right, peace. I was on the third side of this house. 
I was going to do this one last, but I got to go hit the back and it makes it for a little bit easier transition. So make sure you get the garage doors good. Yeah, we're just uh, out there trying to get it, you know. Blessed, man, blessed. That's all we are. Got my little, end of that garage is my uh, marker point. So I'm just trying to spray a little bit of SH. You don't need to go too crazy. It don't take much. I'm going to hit that pole again, though. Because I see some creaking on it. So you got to be cautious with them poles. All right, guys, I'm going to go ahead and soak this and soak that little building. Rinse, hit the back, we're out. Catch up. Peace. Everybody, ladies and gents, got it all done. Looks a hundred times better, as you can tell. This webs are going, everything's going, all good. Did the back patio with just a J-Rod tip. I didn't. It was a year old. I didn't want to put a surface clean on it because it would have jacked it up. So we loading up the trailer now, putting the ladder up. About to roll out. Took about an hour and thirty minutes. Had a lot of detail work to do up top, so not a bad day. Anyway. Nice subdivision. We already cleaned about 15, 20 houses in here and getting more business out of the subdivision. So anyway, appreciate the likes, subs, calls, comments. Sorry for the short video, but we'll try to get back to the house. All right, later. Peace.